fellas, Mugman here, and welcome back to Mugman Plays Super Mario Sunshine. Well, the fun in Doom Eternal has sadly come to an end, so it's back to the grind of cleaning up an entire friggin' island for a vacation. Just what I've always wanted. Ugh. Well, hey, it was a nice break while it lasted. Anyways, let's go get Shadow Mario here at Rico Harbor. Get this mission out of the way right quick. Alright, so let's take care of this dude. I'm on, Shadow Mario. You're going down. Like, you ain't getting out of this. Alright, you get back here. I have to climb grates to chase you. You friggin' wuss. Right, whoa, hey, hey. I need you to actually focus on getting up there, Mario. Come on. There you go. Now you're getting it. Can I just aim and hit him? Like, I want to try that. I want to try and aim and hit him. That kind of worked. All right, let's keep moving. <sighs> I was... I forgot about this. Like, I genuinely put this out of my mind. Just... Uh... It's not a bad game, don't get me wrong. Just... I was hoping for a vacation, and this is not what I had in mind. Okay, where did Shadow Mario go? Because I have lost him. I have lost him? I'm very confused. Wait, did he go up there? Oh, he went up there, didn't he? Let's see. Seriously, where'd he go? I don't see him at all. Maybe he is up here. Let's see. There's a blue coin. I don't see Shadow Mario. Where the frick did he go? I'm honestly kind of shocked he's not anywhere in sight. Where did the stupid Shadow go? I might have to restart the level because I honestly lost him. <laughs> well, this is a great start back, folks. You'll lose the... Oh, there he is. He's on this platform. Okay. All right, let's get spritzed. Spritz him! That takes care of that. Yeah, you'll remember this, all right. I'll remember this vacation for being one of the worst decisions I ever made in my life. It is pretty, though. I just think if it weren't being dealt with like this, maybe I'd have a better time. But unfortunately, that is not the case. So, bleh. Either way, it's another shine sprite done, so we're up to 23. Alright, so we're technically done here, too. So let's see what we gotta do next. Alright, according to the totals guide, we have Gelato Beach, Peanut Park, Serena Beach, and Noki Bay to still deal with, as well as an empty spot. So I'm not gonna worry about that for the moment. Alright, it's been reported that a lone Yoshi egg has been spotted. I already know about that. Thank you for the reminder, but I'm already good in that regard. Alright, so I think next on my list is to go back here. And let's go deal with the Shine Sprites in this area. Let's do this! Okay, I know there's a specific mission here that's going to be frustrating, apparently. Uh, Mirror Madness, Tilt Slam, Bam. No, it's not this one. This one I think is okay. Well, at least I hope it's okay. I don't know if this is the mission that people have been warning me about. Alert, alert, just look at the top of the tower. That is a big wiggler. Did we kick your butt earlier? Now you're taking a nap? Okay, so what are those things? Oh, weird looking. Like, they're round, but they got, like, big beak lips? Some weird things have curled up on the tower to take a nap. This could endanger the legendary sandbird egg. Sandbird? Okay, I don't know what that is, but well, I guess we're gonna find out. Alright. So let's go deal with this and help this sandberg? Sandbird? I don't friggin' know. Who makes a bird out of sand? More importantly, how does a bird made of sand actually live? I didn't think that could be a sentient thing. Alright, well, let's lift the stairs by spritzing a plant. Video game logic be damned! I know cartoon logic is a thing, but man, video game logic takes some weird leaps and bounds, doesn't it? Alright, well, either way, let's get up top and let's survey. So it seems like there's different tiers of this. So let's deal with actually getting up there. That's what we should be dealing with. Uh, what? Okay, wasn't expecting that. Okay, so let's get up to each of the tiers and we'll just kind of go about it as we get there. Okay, 
Let's mount and float up to here. The hover nozzle is the MVP. Like, I'm gonna say that right now. I don't know if I've said it before, but this nozzle just friggin' rocks. Okay, let's... Let's knock him off. Okay. Come on. Come on, you goobers. Okay, maybe I gotta stun them before I... Spray it with water to try and upset its balance. Okay, yeah, no, it pushes them down. Okay, that kinda helps, so... As long as we spritz them... That didn't help at all. Okay, this is... Oh, this is gonna be a pain in the butt, isn't it? Ugh, come on, hold still! Hold still, will ya? Okay, so... Am I doing this right? I don't know it's upsetting them, that's for sure. Okay, let's, uh... Try this again. Spritz them. And hit them! This is not doing a damn thing to them. Am I doing this right? Ugh. I really don't like these things. I really don't. Alright, let's try aiming at them. I think that'll help our case a little bit. Alright, that one's all the way down. Oh! Okay, so we gotta get them, like, all the way down until they're, like, ready to trip. And then we'll be fine. Well, that makes sense, I suppose. Get them all the way to the very edge, that would throw anyone's balance off. Though, probably it's my fault for choosing to do the third one first. That was kind of a dumb move on my part, but, I mean, it was the closest thing to me, what do you expect? Okay, so that shifts the mirror onto... that thing. Okay. So I'm guessing once it gets all of them, it'll, like, get the wiggler off the freaking bubble? Is it a bubble? I don't even know what it is. It's like some sort of weird... It's like, usually when, like, they put fancy things on towers, like, there's always that weird-looking, like, emblem thing. You know what I mean, right? Like, at the very top of it. You know, there's always those weird structures that make no sense, and they're just there for artistic purposes. Which, there's a question I got for you guys. What art piece is there out there that you find weird, but you can't help but admire it? Alright, get off the thing! Let me know what your favorite artistic piece is that's just kind of weird, but at the same time you can't help but admire it. Personally, there's like this weird reflective bean, I think? I think it's a bean. I don't know what it is. But basically it's like super reflective, it's almost like a mirror. But it's basically like a giant jelly bean. I don't know where it is, but I saw a picture of it the one day and it just... It's such a bizarre thing, but at the same time it's kind of fascinating. Let me know what your favorite weird artistic thing is. Kinda curious. Okay, so let's wait. There's a freaking shine sprite in a juice bar. Why is there a shine sprite in a juice bar? That doesn't make any sense. Like, these things are supposed to be powering your island and yet you're keeping them in the most bizarre of places! I don't get these people. I sincerely don't get these people. Like, okay. You're telling me. Okay, I'm gonna logic this. I know I shouldn't be, I know it's a video game, but I can't help it. This is aggravating me. You have a power source that has been scattered because of the inky paint-like substance that is necessary to the survival of your species. You know, like these things that have been drifting away are necessary for your survival, and yet, and yet, you opt to make them prizes to be won, or things to be given to you for charitable acts. Instead of, oh, I don't know, uh, giving them back to the main power source, and did that thing just fall apart? Like, it literally just fell to pieces, like... That was kind of morbid. Like, I know it's a game, but good lord. That is one horrible way to go out. Just falling right to pieces. Like, sheesh. Alright, that's another shine sprite in the bag, so whatever. There you go, I suppose. Ugh. Still, it doesn't make any sense. Like, if this is their power source, then why are they being so stingy? I don't get it. It doesn't make much sense, and it's kind of pissing me off a little. Like, 
These guys are supposed to be protecting this thing. Not freaking using them as things to be won. Or just things to be earned, you know? Like, I get s saving people's lives and all, but this is ridiculous. Uh-oh. All right, we got a Wiggler. We have to fight him again? Or maybe we haven't fought him, and this is the first time we're fighting him. I, I have lost track. Okay, so what do we do about this? This thing is huge. All right. I'll protect the dune, bud. You'll see. Um, not sure if that's exactly what we should be doing right now. I think we should be using these to friggin' uh, do one of these. Yeah, there we go. All right. And now onto its body. Okay, so we have to attack the section that's lit up with the arrow. Right? And boom! Oop, wrong one! There we go. Okay, so that... Oh, no, it's coming back up. Oh, that is an angry wiggler. All right. Now it's angry. All right, gotta use the butt again. Okay, that launches it up. Okay, so we don't need to, like, time it. We can just let it launch and then... Oh, hit the thing. Hit the... No! Hit the... Oh, for the love of Pete. Hit it. There we go. All right, so one more time ought to do it, right? You see these things go in threes. All right, so we just gotta wait one more time as this thing barrels out of... Wait, what? Huh? Oh boy. Okay, here it comes. In the most bizarre way possible. Okay, is it coming down here or what? Doesn't seem like it. Oh, I know, yeah, it is. I, I think. Uh, is it coming anywhere near us or am I gonna have to go over there? Alright, let's try to do the thing. Uh, is it coming this way? Don't think it is. Okay, so it seems like we're gonna have to hit this one. But it doesn't seem like it's coming toward this one any time. The other one any time. Yeah, no, it's not coming toward there. All right, this is the one we gotta hit now. Okay, let's do it. It's a lump out. You know, typically that would run someone over in a heartbeat, but not in this game. All right, let's friggin' jump across its little legs. Oh boy. Can I even hit this? Oh, son of a... Oh, I don't like you. I don't like you one bit. Okay, now I'm pissed. Okay, this little wiggler's about to get got. I say little wiggler, but Jesus. Okay, hit the plant. Hit the bean. I do love it actually does kind of mess with Mario too. Like... Yeah, it's a seismic shock. What do you expect? Are you actually gonna be fine after that? Wabushki! Alright, so the Wiggler got turned to sin. I swear we've done this. And we haven't? Or maybe this is just more a more aggressive version of the fight? Either way, it's done. Either way, it's done. Let's just go get the shine sprite, call it a day, and we'll be freaking fine. Helps us to 25. Nice! Okay, that takes care of that nonsense, folks. Seriously, did we fight it before? I can't remember now. Oh boy, now I gotta deal with Shadow Mario, and there's a nozzle for us. Okay, so I guess it's relevant. Let's go get him. Yeah, I know, the Debs alert's gonna let me know about all that. Thank you. Mysterious mustachioed man. Yes, I already know, that's... Okay, around uh-huh yeah whatever okay let's get him how you can jump with that in your hands just baffles me well then again Mario can do that too so maybe it's just a Mario thing I don't know I wouldn't be able to be that acrobatic holding a giant metal spinning fan thing of a bobber seriously like how would anyone realistically be able to do flips and kicks and jumps like a stage performer Holding a giant friggin' water fan. You tell me. And that don't make much sense. Oh, great. Well, this is gonna be fun. Alright. Back up there. Wait, did we deal with that thing? What? Is there anything in there? 
Oh no. It looks weird. It looks all wiggly. Alright, rats! It was just about to turbo dash too. Okay, so we got a turbo dashing nozzle. Okay, what does that do? Is this the first time we've used this? Let's see. Whoa! Oh, that's pretty friggin' fast! Hey, hold on. I thought for sure we could, like, run through the door. Alright, let's try hitting another door. Hey, there's one over there. Let's go into the police station. Freeze FBI! Wait, what? Is this a friggin' secret level? Oh, boy. Alright. Okay, I see what we gotta do here. Okay, so we gotta turbo nozzle our way through this. Seems like there's water already here, so I guess all we gotta do is jump. Okay, just gotta jump at the right times, and we should be okay. I think. I don't know for sure, but we're gonna try it! Alright, going up the ramp, and that'll recharge our water. Wow, water drains fast on this thing, so you gotta be, like, perfect. Okay, whoa! Okay. Come on, Mario! And, whoa! Huh! First try! That's a rarity, but I'll take it! Cool. Got another shine sprite. We're up to 26. Good. <sighs> this vacation, man. I swear. After this, I'd like something fun. Like, this is fun, but not, like, fun fun. Like, there's fun that's annoying, and then there's fun that's just fun. This is fun that's annoying me, man. All right. Let's do at least one more mission. We should have enough for one. Unless it's, like, a secret, in which case, screw it. We're ending it here. Let's see, what are we gonna get? I mean, not four shines, but I feel like we can end off if that's the case. Okay, what do we got? The sandbird is born. Oh, no, 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 no. We're stopping here. I don't give a flying hoot. I've heard about the sandbird. I know about this, because Kai warned me about this bird. We're stopping here. And we're going to continue next episode because I feel like dealing with the Sandbird will be more fun with a fresher mindset than one that's already frustrated. So tune in next time as we deal with the Sandbird. But until then, thank you all so very much for watching. If you enjoyed this, please leave a like and a comment in the boxes below letting me know your favorite moments from this episode. Also be sure to subscribe, hit the notification bell, and make sure all notifications are turned on so that way you know when I'm dealing with a Sandy Bird. Also, share this video around. Your continued viewership and support is greatly appreciated. And, of course, a very special thanks to the Tier 2 and Tier 3 Patreon supporters. Those being Sebastian Canino, Aaron Lena, iShipit88, JesseBarbo6, Panda475, Nagi Oki, SwordFoxMC, Jay Zolman, Senboy, Angelique De La Rouge, Nicole Simcoe, Mike Glorified, Cyanide Cupcake, Brianna on Sale, Honor Higgins, Jesse Alvarez, Horizon Dreamer, Hunter Hunt 999, Grimillion, Zodiac Demirs, Ruby the Wolf, Harley Wolf, and Katie Honey Jade. If you'd like to support the Patreon family, as well as get videos 24 hours in advance, along with exclusive Let's Plays, check the link in the description below to our Patreon. And with that said, this is Bugman, and I'll be seeing ya! Bye bye